Nice touch into Ethan Ross, down to the channel. Ben Williamson, Matty, the D takes a bit of time. Oh, plays off the defender, and Ben Williamson heads it in. I think it's off the line. No, it's, it's off, off the, line. the line. But the referee has overruled the linesman by the looks of things. And it's a goal, yeah, well, it's handshakes it all round. Like it's 1-0 Wraith Rovers. Good header by Matthews. That asks a question of the fullback. Williamson's in, Williamson's well done, in, he's 1-1 one 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 with the goalkeeper. And, and goal, goal, second of the game. Are two goals up as Ben Williamson scores his second goal for Wraith Rovers. Celebrates in front of the Aki's fans who were giving him a bit of grief. Pushing, probing, looking for a way through. Meganson in the inside right channel. Miss Meganson! And he gets the goal that could take Cove Rangers up to the championship. And who else but the most reliable goal scorer in the club's history finally finds a way past that rock of a defence so far this afternoon from Dumbarton. He found that little bit of space. That was all he needed. And Mitch Meganson drills it in for his 16th league goal of the season.
signing for a place yeah. and ends up doing quite well as Henderson can drive it as Falkirk defence he's in the box he gets on the right foot he's got options there lays off Kevin Colley yes! and it's an early goal for Alwa it's the number seven the Wasp hero Kevin Colley smashes home to make it 1-0 in the seventh minute great to see the frustration and there's not much quality from either side in this half just gifting the ball back to one another that's what I'd be into it's Salmon pickpockets Dixon and here's Connor Salmon against his former club <laughs> he swats <laughs> into the bottom corner it's poetic <laughs> it's Falkirk now Alawa to Connor Salmon the hero there's Morrison up against Senna once more tossing turning still doing it gets on his left foot whips it in that's a good ball oh. and Falkirk are back into the game it's headed in by Anton Dowds. It was a good ball in from Morrison. Nisbet headed it across and Dowds. Jack Brown, obviously, a long-term signing, so he'll be hoping to play his way into Jim McAnally's plans for next season. But it's been so difficult for him coming in when you've got people like Ryan Duncan, Naya Payne, Grant Savory putting in the kind of performances they are. Hamish Ritchie, lovely play from Peter Head. It's Jack Brown! Oh, oh. Just as we're speaking about him... It's a lovely Peterhead goal, beautiful football, and it's Jack Brown that gets the goal. Tids it, in the first up, off the post, Dougie Hill, taps it in! Poor from Forfer there, not clearing the ball, it looked like an easy one to get away, but felt to defeat Dougie Hill and he did what he needed to do. And what could be his final game here at New Central Park. Ball back taken. There's a shot by Warnock, and it's a brilliant goal. Warnock equalises for four for Athletic. What a strike! Jameson had no chance there. Forward it comes, Uzi nods up, nice wee nod down to Ryan Shanley there. It's back with Uzi C, he gives him it again. Shanley is through here in this area, he's going to have a goal. It's a shot and it's a goal! 12 minutes gone here at Edinburgh City. It's 1-0, it's Ryan Shanley. Sorry, with the corner kick, and it goes. Heads it up at the back, it's a nice nod down and it's a cracker! Uzi C makes it two in 19 minutes. City on fire tonight. It's Edinburgh City two and an athletic nil. Considering what's at stake. But Aaron began to pick up a wee bit more of the play. That's Johnson. Plays out to the near side to Barnes. Oh, and that's in the back of the net. Aaron have uh, put one back. Give himself a short option, but looks like this ball played, played back here to, to Sean McIntosh. Puts the ball across, the ball headed on, yeah. and that's 1 0. Yeah. It was a corner that caught the Warriors at the last time. Bobby Robertson, number two. Split through to Burns, was stopped out there by Brown. Uh, Robertson running the ball back there, could kick Nick Gennett off, out the feet from Corbett, puts the ball across in the box. Falls to Hilton, has a shot! Yeah! That's 2 0. <laughs> and now Sunar looking to counter, looking for that third. Brian through the middle now. Walker wide to Yates, puts the ball in the box. And that's with Hilton on the far side, it's a shot! And it's yeah! Right, that's three. O'Reilly, back to line. Line puts the left foot across into Brown. He's all down in the box and looks to turn. There's a shot. 
Here's a goal back for the Warriors. Oh, it looks like and still an Aberdeen and scored. That was a long ball that came from the, uh, the still an Aberdeen defence. Dale Carrick gets in. I have to say, that was an unlucky pass from David Wilson. Well, very well executed with that half volley pass. Charlie Riley collects it. He turns well, he does well, he drives into the box. He tries to cut it back to Kyle Dockery and it's blocked. David Wilson on the volley and it is in! David Wilson scores on the edge of the box! There, I was just saying it in the first half where David Wilson does know how to score from outside the box. What a goal from the midfielder.